Hey guys, this is John Fitch, and uh, as you can see today, it's raining. And uh, I thought it'd be a good chance to show off my new uh, Ion Pro Air Pro camera that I, that uh, comes waterproof and about half the price of a, uh, a GoPro. And also, I wanted to show off this new Sims uh, Challenger Series jacket. Uh, Sims has come out with a uh, kind of a bass line uh, of clothing and it includes the Challenger Series jacket and Challenger Series bib. I don't have the bib though, so I can't show that one off. But uh, so far, it seems to be perfect. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Uh, you know, I do quite a bit of bass fishing and uh, down here in, uh, in Houston, Texas, uh, we don't get very, very cold. I mean, it's December 31st today, and it's uh, 60 degrees at 8 o'clock in the morning. Uh, so <laughs> we usually don't need very thick jackets down here. I mean, it does get pretty cold. And I have to say, this jacket probably, you might want something a little bit thicker when it gets down to about 40 degrees. Um, but uh, it's been, you know, working real good. Uh, as you can see, it it's, uh, looks good. Um, got a lot of features I'll show you on in a second and uh, right now I think it comes in uh, black and a little kind of a hunter orange so but I went, in, went ahead and go for the black but uh, it's very waterproof the first thing you'll notice when putting it on is the uh, nice large zipper very large zipper and I like the way the uh, the velcro is on here instead of it being a solid strap it's smaller little pieces so you can kind of throw it on when you're in the boat and when you get to a spot and especially when it's not cold we're not gonna wear the jacket the entire time you're fishing but uh, you know you get to a spot you, you throw your life vest off and you just rip your jacket off and get going you know, so it kind of keeps it nice and easy to take off when it's on the velcro when you're using the velcro. And a lot of times I use the velcro just you know all the whole day, won't even zip it up. But you know, like I said, we don't have very uh, very harsh winters here in Houston, and uh, I know a lot of the South is pretty much the same. You know, there's a lot of humidity and uh, warm air. <laughs> so uh, like I said, this this jacket's worked out pretty good for me. As you can see, it's got some nice you know big pockets. You stick your hands way down in there. Um, it has a little side pocket here. It's just real handy because it's got a little cleaning thing for your glasses. That's an awesome feature. It's got one inside pocket. Your valuables. And uh, also on the outside pockets here, it's kind of interesting. I know y'all can't see it, but I can feel it. Uh, but on the outside liner, it has fleece, and on the inside liner, I guess it's just the regular jacket material, which is kind of neat because it allows the body heat to penetrate through your pocket, but the fleece on the outside kind of keeps it insulated from the outside weather and temperature. So that's a really nice feature, and it also keeps it more slim. You know, it's, it's not so bulky because it's such a light jacket, which is perfect for down here um, and probably anywhere else. It's like the when you. As long as you're not in that 40 degree range, I'd say that's when my comfort zone says, "Hey, I need something thicker." Uh, and pretty much, also, it's really easy to see. I don't know; it's kind of light right now, but uh, it's really reflective. And you can see the back, like a nice big sense in the back. It's got like a nice reflective wrist pattern here. It's got nice Velcro wrist, so you can tighten it down as much as you want. Um, another great feature is the hoodie. Like I, I like the hoodie a lot because it has a uh, it has multiple points of adjustment. You can throw it on with your hat and keep it big, or you could, you know, if you're not a hat wearer, take your hat off, throw that sucker up there, pull this pull this string back here, and it'll tighten up to your head. And uh, that that works pretty dang good too. It also has another uh, tighten feature on this side too for those cold days. You know, you zip up all the way. It's got a nice kind of turtleneck look to it, and then you can tighten this sucker down and keep as much keep as much wind out as possible. Keep as much of your heat in as possible. I guess is the best way to, to say it. 
but uh, like I said, it's definitely a very functional jacket. It's uh, not hard to fish with. It's very lightweight. I don't really need it. Um, and uh, like I said, it's definitely definitely going to be my go-to jacket for, for for quite a while now. But I, I hope you enjoyed this review. I'm trying to think of anything else that, that y'all'd like to know about it. Um, like I said, it's extremely waterproof. You don't have to worry about getting your clothes wet unless you want it to get wet. You know, like me, I'm stubborn. Even when I, even when it's raining, if it ain't raining hard, I don't ever put the hoodie on. You know, I've got a hat for that. <laughs> but uh, that, like I said, that just may, might be me. So, uh, like I said, I hope you enjoyed this review. Um, you might want to go ahead and check out the Ion camera. Uh, that's what I'm recording with today. It uh, it comes waterproof. You don't need any kind of uh, enclosure. So it might be right down the alley for any fishermen out there. To, and it's a heck of a lot cheaper. Uh, I think I got mine uh, uh, for about 50 bucks. And now you do have to buy a separate uh, memory card and any other kind of attachments that you want to it. But uh, so far I'm happy with it. And we'll see how this video comes out with it's raining. I know there's probably a couple of raindrops on there, but uh, hopefully it's not too bad. But uh, I'd like to say thank y'all for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, comment, like. Uh, if you have any questions about the jacket, I'd go into further detail with you. And uh, I'll look forward to the next video. And uh, Todd Lines, everyone.